Let's get the elf plane loaded. Radio, wind the engine. Roger that, Mr. Elf. Wind the engine. Radio. Hi, boys. Hi, Hi girls. What's happening? Dad has an important job to do. What kind of job? He's flying to the North Pole. The North Pole? Yes, we're making our final delivery of toys to Father Christmas. Ooh! Flight 1000, ready for takeoff. Flight 1000, you are cleared for takeoff. Roger that, Control. to Father Christmas. Well, who do you think makes all Father Christmas's toys? Um, elves? That's right, us elves. Ah. Elves work all year deep underground in the elf factory making toys. Then, in December, Ben's dad flies to the North Pole and delivers the toys to Father Christmas. Does he land at the North Pole and meet Father Christmas? No, he never lands. He drops the toys by parachute. Then Father Christmas wraps the toys up and delivers them to the children of the world. All the children? Even our friend Lucy? Oh yes, even Lucy. I love Christmas. And I love snow. Me too. I wish it was snowing now. Yes, it's Christmas Eve. When's it going to snow? Maybe it's time for a weather forecast. Weather forecast? Yes, we can use my elf weather detector. Wow! So can this machine tell if it's going to snow? Of course. How does it work? I listen to the weather through this giant ear trumpet. It's so sensitive, I can hear a butterfly flapping its wings in Africa. Can you hear any butterflies? Ah, don't talk loudly into the trumpet. Sorry, wise old elf. Now, please stay quiet. Ah, interesting. Is it a butterfly? No, I can hear weather. What sort of weather? Uh, <clears throat> there's a chance of sun or rain with clear skies or clouds. Is it going to snow? I can say it certainly might, but then again, it might not. Oh. I know. Let's ask Nanny Plum if it's going to snow. Why ask Nanny Plum? Nanny can tell the future. Ha! This I must see. <laughs> Nanny Plum! Nanny Plum! You can tell the future, can't you? I certainly can. Can you tell if it's going to snow today? Yes, I'll use my special snow forecasting globe. Oh, oh, I see. You gaze into the crystal ball and it tells our fortune, I suppose. <laughs> no, you just shake it, like this. There we are. It'll snow today. Hooray! Stop, stop, stop. How on earth can that thing predict the weather? It's never been wrong. What if you shook it in the summer? Well, you don't shake it in the summer, obviously. That would be silly. Well, you can't tell exactly when it's going to snow, can you? Yes, I can. It's going to snow now. Abracadabra. That's cheating. No, it's not. Make it snow. Nanny's made it snow. Let's go and see it. <laughs> what? But where is the snow? Yeah! Nanny Plum! It's snowing inside! Wow! <laughs> snow! Snow! <laughs> Let's play snowballs! Ooh, Nanny Plum! It's snowing in the sitting room! Is this your doing? Yes, it is! 
Inside is for sitting in armchairs and reading. Outside is for snow. Oh, inside, outside, whatever. Nanny Plum, you're fired. <laughs> Don't be silly. I'm taking away your wand until you learn how to control your spells better. But what about the snow? Not another word. Aww. Everyone out. Now Daddy's taken Nanny Plum's wand. She won't be able to magic any snow. Now we won't have any snow for Christmas. There's always a chance it might snow anyway. I can hear something. Is it snow? No, it's the elf plane. Dad's back from the North Pole. <laughs> That's the last delivery done. Dad, did you see snow? Yes, lots of it. Enough snow to last me a lifetime. Now you've finished your work, Mr. Elf. Are you on holiday? Holiday? Good gracious, no. It's Christmas Eve. There's work to be done preparing tonight's Elf and Fairy Feast. Oh, yes, the Midnight Elf and Fairy Feast. On Christmas Eve. With music and singing and lanterns. Yes, and those lanterns don't hang themselves up to work. Stop, Mr. Elf. It's about time you had a rest. A rest? You've been working hard all year. Just sit down and relax for five minutes. I can give you three. You work too hard. Elves like working hard. And I'm an elf. <gasps> oh dear, you really must relax. Just say, I'm on holiday. Well, all right. I'm on holiday. Ah. That's nice. Hello? Wise old elf speaking? <laughs> it's Father Christmas here. Oh, Mr. Christmas. We seem to be missing some toys. I can't find Box 571. Box 571? I need those toys before tonight. Or some children will not get their Christmas presents. Never fear, Mr. Christmas. We will get the box to you. I will deliver it personally. Box 571? It could be anywhere. We'll never find it. Is it this box, Dad? The one that says Box 571? What? Well done, Ben. You found it. To the elf plane. We leave immediately. Well, that was a nice holiday, while it lasted. Are you going back to the North Pole? Can we come? Can we, Dad? Please? Please, Miss Elf. I don't mind who comes, but we must leave straight away. Hooray! Brilliant! I'll just get my wands back from King Thistle and then... There's no time for that, Nanny. We need to get these toys to Father Christmas right away. Elf honour is at stake. Ready for takeoff, Captain. Everyone on board. Ben, it's snowing. Oh, wow! Snow! You see, my snow globe is never wrong. Hmm. What do all these buttons do? Don't touch anything, please, Nanny Plum. Wind the engine. Righty ho! Ready for takeoff. 